Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you not one, not two, but 10 amazing SEO tools for beginners. Let's take a look. Okay, so here's the thing. I'm sure you must have seen a lot of videos or lists talking about SEO tools, but there's a problem with many of these videos. One, these tools are usually too technical and meant for advanced SEO users. I mean, everybody knows about SEO, but nobody has time to do these crazy advanced SEO stuff, right? We need results and we need it right now. So the tools I'm gonna to talk about is super easy to use and meant for anyone, not the advanced level bullshit. The second thing is that most of the tools that usually get mentioned in videos and lists are usually paid and expensive. In India, we all know how price conscious we are. No matter how awesome the products are, we all want it free. So I made it a point to add only those SEO tools that are either completely free or offer a free version. No money involved. Okay, so without wasting any more time with my bug bug talk, let's get straight to the point. 10 amazing SEO tools that everyone can use. Oh, and by the way, it took me a whole day to research on this topic and put this video together. So please share it with your friends if you like it. Okay, so first tool, it's called Copyscape. This is a must use for anyone new to SEO or blogging. Basically what this tool does is that it checks if somebody copy pasted your content into their website. So let's say you published a blog post. You know that if you copy pasted the content that you published on your blog from somewhere else, Google won't show it on the search results. And it's basically bad for your website. But what if somebody else copied your content? This tool helps to check that. It scans the entire internet and tells you if somebody has copied your content and if there's similar content like your website anywhere on the internet. Our second tool is called Google PageSpeed Insights. This is an official tool from Google that helps you to find out what is wrong with your website. It checks if your website is slow and if yes, what is making it slow? Is it the theme, the images or something else? It tells you clearly where and what is wrong with your website or blog. It is completely free and from Google, so check it out. So the third one is Hemingway app. This is one of my favorite ones. You see, when we write content on our websites, we all think that it's amazing, right? Only when someone reads it, they will find the mistakes in it. So this tool does just that. Either you copy paste your content from where you're writing, like on Google Docs or on your blog itself, or by typing in this app itself. While you type, this tool will tell you what are the mistakes in your writing and gives you a score. Whether your content is good for reading or not, it will tell you. It shows you suggestions to improve also. It's completely free and a must have tool in every blogger's toolkit. Fourth tool is called Ahrefs Link Checker. So you probably already know that the more other websites link to your website, the more popular your website gets, right? So how do we know which website is linking to your blog? This tool will tell you. This tool will show you all the details about which website is linking to you, how did they link, whether that link is good or not, whether that website is good or not, and everything related to links. Check it out, the link is in the description. Okay, so the fifth tool is called WooRank. I like the name. This tool is like an x-ray machine for your website. Just give your website address and this tool will scan your entire website like an x-ray machine and tell you everything about it that is wrong and right. Even stuff that you didn't know. It will tell you your SEO is correct or not, what is wrong, how you can fix it, which are the top pages, etc, etc, etc. Amazing tool and totally, totally free. Check it out. Okay, so the sixth tool is called Exploding Topics. Easy to remember, right? So this is a brand new tool in the market. Here's what it does. Let's say your blog is about fashion and you already know what is trending in the industry because everybody is writing about it. Now, what is the next trend? Would you know that? It would be nice if you can know what is the next trend so that you can start writing about it before it actually becomes a trend, right? So this is what exactly this tool does. It'll tell you what is the upcoming trend in your industry so that you can be ready. Try it out, it's absolutely free and easy to use. Seventh tool on the list is called SEO Dub. Do you have any guesses what it is? Okay, so you already know that there are a lot of SEO tools that tracks your website's rankings, right? Like for example, if you have a keyword, the tools will tell you where your website is ranking on Google's search results. This is the usual stuff. 
but the SEO dub tool does something little bit more. So not only will it tell you what your current rank is, it will also tell you what your future rank will be for your website. Nice, right? Try it out. The link is in the description. Eighth one is called Nibbler. Nibbler. Nibbler is a free SEO tool that gives you a full SEO report of your website. And it's not a normal, usual SEO report. It will scan your website or the blog and tell you how popular it is, how people will like your website, what have you done wrong, and more. It's so much value I'm telling you because it tells you everything free that some SEO agency usually charges hundreds of dollars for. Please check it out. Okay, so the ninth tool is called sanitycheck.io. This might sound like a little advanced tool, but no, it isn't. Hear me out. So you probably already know that Google has a free product called Google Search Console, right? No problem if you don't know it, I'll tell you what. So if you add your website to Google Search Console, it'll come with some basic stuff and tell you what is going on with your website. Like for example, which keywords give you most traffic, other basic SEO setup, etc. But there's a problem with this Google tool. It does not give you anything useful or actionable. Like what do you have to do with all these stuff, all this data? You have to do a lot of hard work to figure out things. Now, otherwise, it's just a lot of data and numbers. This is where a tool like Sanity Check comes into picture. It scans your Google Search Console data and tells you all the useful things like what to do, which pages have gone down, which pages have gone up in traffic, and what can you do to make your website better? And what change should you make to your content? After all, that is what we need, right? What you should do to get the results you need. You don't need those fancy data and all that stuff. That's just PS. I love this tool. I'm sure you will too. Please check it out. Okay, so the last tool, the 10th one is called Mobile Rank Checker. As the name suggests, it's pretty easy, but very, very useful. You know that Google search results are different in every city and every country, right? That is, even if you type in the same search phrase in India and USA, the results will be totally different. So if you search for, let's say, iPhone in India and USA, Google search results in India will be totally different from that in the USA. So as bloggers, how will you know if your website is showing on the first page of Google in another country or let's say city? By using this tool. You can choose the country and even city, then give the search phrase and this tool will show you what the search result is in that city or country for that search phrase. Very, very useful. Let's say you're a blogger in Delhi and you wanna know what the search results are for the search phrase in let's say Chennai or down south, you can use this tool and figure it out. It's totally free, please try. Okay, so that was a long one, right? All the tools I mentioned are linked in the video description and comments, so go check it out. The URLs are posted there. By the way, I got one more favor to ask you. Please share this video on social media, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, whatever it is. Lots of people keep asking me, hey, money, your content is amazing, your videos are good, but why are there no much views on it? I usually get like 100 views or something on every video. The reason is that nobody is actually sharing it, not even me, to be honest. So if you like this video and if you think it is useful for your friends, please share with them on Messenger, Facebook, LinkedIn, what have you, and let's see what happens. That will make me smile for sure. Okay, so actually I have some more unknown SEO tools that I wanna share with you, but including them in this video will make it super long. So I thought I'll do it in another video, maybe you know a second part of this video, if I get enough traction and views on this video. So please let me know in comments if you wanna know more such lesser known free SEO tools and I'll be happy to share in another video. I hope you like this video. Please like, share and subscribe. This is Mani Karthik signing off.